everybody, it's the man with no name here. We're back for mission number five, Unbroken. This mission, I will be a little disclosure, will kind of be like the last uh, Pavlov's house and the Cold Supper. It's more of a stealthy mission in a way. Um, so just kind of a, a little disclaimer that might be a little bit slower paced. Uh, it has some action in it, but it uh, it takes a little bit to get to those points. Uh, started off pretty into it, but then we just kind of slow way down. But without further ado, it is on hardcore and fog of war is enabled. Let's get into it. The defining moment for Soviet partisans was, without a doubt, the Vitsyevsk Gate. This hole in the Eastern Front Line, basically a Soviet-controlled corridor, became the central hub for partisan activities and traffic. Seeing its potential, Soviet strategists started supporting the partisan units on a very different level. The Red Army organized centralized administrative and logistical support, and the gate became a big factor in supporting partisan troops in German-held territory with weapons. This enabled the partisan units to become a big factor, inflicting very heavy damage to the German supply chain. German terror campaigns that followed took a terrible toll. In the end, this drove civilians out of their homes and villages and into the camps of the partisans. In this mission, you'll be given the chance to prove yourself as a partisan. Get a chance to prove ourselves and no good luck. I like it. Simple action plan, I like it. Occupied Ukraine. Hmm. Well, guess we'll figure it out. Upon arrival to the village, I want the prisoners dealt with and the men gathered for a sweep of the marshes. The command wants us to rat out a problematic partisan group. Scheiße! I lost control of the steering! The brakes are also down, god verdammt!
товарищ командир. Welcome to Opsich, comrades. I'm in charge here. The fascists are sending a lot of their convoys through these roads nowadays. We try to target the easy ones with supplies. We could use your help. The Germans are doing something to our village. It has become a fortified supply nexus. They've reinforced the sector and we know nothing of our people. We fear the worst. We'll join you, comrade. But first, we need to get the hell out of here before the Germans know what hit them. Agreed. Follow us. We'll take you to our hideout. Alright, so we're gonna expect a counterattack. Ah, counterattack. Plot. Spoiler alert, I know. Yep, works for me. Let's see here. Take two. Have him dig. So yeah, they'll they'll they're gonna counterattack. Just kind of a a little bit of a heads up here for everybody. If you haven't played this, I'm not trying to give you spoilers, but you know, obviously, if you're watching this before you play it, then you're either stuck or you enjoy the content. So there's that aspect of it too. <clears throat> so basically, all we're gonna do here is we are going to make it very difficult for them to come this way which is where kind of the primary focus is going to be at they're going to come off that road which i think they come from technically over this way from the swamp and then this way down the road is the village <coughs> it's also a multiplayer map or from skirmish uh, co-op or it's also in the conquest series map as well as you know it goes into the village over here i think there's a little uh, no it's about the same actually take it back now over here this is all the same you actually i think you get a little bit more over here than you normally do i don't know i could be mistaken <clears throat> We're not even going to worry about over here. And the reason for that is, is, <laughs> well, I've played this a few times, this mission in particular, but uh, there's mortars that come over here, and that's kind of what I'm worried about. Um,. That's my uh, biggest concern, if you will. So basically, I want to make it very hard for these mortars to just kind of get through. And the infantry as well, that would be, that would be the secondary objective. My main objective is to take out as all this infantry if possible. Uh, the 
the mortars are the my primary concern for me and then everything else will be uh, secondary so I mean obviously they're gonna take out a bunch of infantry that that's fine that's great but my biggest thing is gonna be the uh, mortars because they will desecrate us if we're not careful unfortunately he only has like seven only has five should be good there all right we'll send you guys back some people need guns still primary then we'll get secondary as well some people don't even have some of these guys don't even have guns I don't think I know we need to go ahead and put that AT gun alright cool Alright, we'll give him a rifle. Probably just go ahead and make him like a ultimate baddie there. All right, so we got him. He's done. Um. Yeah, that'll be fine there. And then. He needs more ammo. <coughs> kind of forgot. Um, I'm actually going to make this guy my. Um, where's it at? There he is. MP40. I would also like him to get an MP40, if all possible. There's not one out, another one over here. Oh, here it is. Alright, let's see here. Ooh, AT grenade too. Nice. All right, cool. I think we're done there. And then we'll go ahead and add a last. Yeah, be fine. We just need to get him over here. So yeah, they're, they're primarily going to come from here, um, that's where I put all my mines as you can see. Uh, you will get, we'll have a half track or something come up in here, and then infantry coming from this way too, just randomly, but mainly the mortars and the, the half track. The German track. activity in the village is alarmingly high. There is a reckless German officer stationed there, and the Soviet high command has requested we terminate him. All entrances are guarded. This fascist swine is important. With your men, we will attempt to infiltrate the village, take out the armor, and most importantly, do not let the fascist officer escape alive. If we can strike a hard blow against the Hitlerite hordes, hopefully they will leave our village alone.
And you guys are probably like, why do you know so much about this? It took me forever to beat this game. What? Impossible. This mission. Somebody has given away our hideout. I should have never trusted you. Traitors. Traitor? What are you talking about, fool? Stop this nonsense, comrade! We've not betrayed you! I wish they would just fix this voice audio. It's kind of one of the only complaints I have about this game. Because this campaign has been out for a really long time. Overkill. There's half truck. They're coming. The Germans are coming. The Germans are coming. All right, cool. Take defensive positions. We will defend this place until the last man. There's ammo, weapons, and equipment in the crates. Take what you need. And we're going to put these guys back here. Yeah. Alright, cool. Now all I'm gonna do is wait for that MG to get there. I don't know what you're saying, but... I probably would agree with you. Right. Shit! Hammerman! Line that vehicle and get them from behind before that MG42 kills us all! throw a grenade in this uh Let's see here here it is Let's see if I can get him hopefully it'll just blow it up blow him up kill him there we go cool
It's just because I'm OCD, there's nothing else to it. Uh, there we go. There's this. Mine's blowing up. Let's see if I can go ahead and fix this. Where was those mines at? Over here, right? There they are. I see you. Задали им Still coming. I thought we were done. Buddy.
Defend the camp. I like Great it. work, comrades. Now our position is compromised. We must proceed with our plans of liberating Opsich and terminating the fascist commanding officer. <laughs> I need your squad to move swiftly. Some of my men are acting as spotters in the village. Cut off any escape routes the officer may want to use. We will attack when you give us the signal. See, that's that's where I would that's where I would lose. If the officer is compromised, he will try to escape. You must have all exits covered by the time you give us the attack signal. I'll give you three of my best men to help you in this dangerous task. That's gotta count for something. He has a car 98 with a bayonet on it. Um, okay. He's got a 4.7 and a 4.7. I guess there's the lieutenant right there. I just need a bombing run. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's see if we can. I'm gonna take this Nagat pistol. Put it back over here. Слушай. Yeah. Is he dead? All right. Let's. <laughs> we'll see here in a second if he is dead or not. So yeah. Um now you see why I didn't use the Go ahead and prepare this real quick. What is he shooting at? Okay. Clearly there's... Oh, here's the mortars. Heck yeah. That worked out perfectly, actually. So, yeah. There's mortar number one and mortar number two. That worked out. Alright, you guys go ahead and come on up here. Is there any MGs? MP41s. I'm just looking for MP40. No, it does not appear to be any MGs. Which does stink. Yeah, 
they're coming to. Oh, here's a 3.7. Cool. Alrighty. So. Basically, what we are going to have to do is we are just going to have to, uh, Stinks because Well, I have limited uh, resources, I guess you could say. Let's bring that along. Bring all that. Let's kind of be a house for supplies here. Alright, where's my... Is this my guy? No. Wait, maybe it is. Yes. That's my Nagat guy down here. So, key here is stealth. We don't want anybody to, uh... Where is... Partisan and partisan. Now this part is hard because we need to basically keep everybody alive. But then we're also having to uh, mine everything too. <clears throat> All right, we're gonna have this three-man team here. Oh, four-man team, I guess. Alrighty. He's gonna hang out. Let's see here, three hundred, three hundred. I'll have a hundred. Actually, take it back. You can have that ammo because. I think we'll have enough here. Alright. <clears throat> Actually, we're going to do this. We're just going to sneak straight into the marshes here. Hopefully we don't have any problems. Put him. I think for maneuverability, I think we'll go ahead and get on this eight centimeter, and then we will just kind of keep it chill for now. Yes, 
Ждем приказа. Так точно? Поесть, конечно, бы не мешало. Уже идем. We're just gonna go and pack this up. Понял. Is that? Yeah, we got 60 rounds. All right, cool. Now we'll bring him back here. This will be. Мы готовы ко всему. Cool. Как скажете. Cool. Так точно. К бою готов. Unfortunately, this is just the process. <coughs> There's not an easy way to really do it. In my opinion, I've never found an easier way to do it. Unfortunately, I w you know, there's mines here. So trying to go this way is not very feasible. You might be able to do it, but I've not been successful, so. Now basically, all you have to do is <coughs> sneak these guys across and they're occasionally have to watch their path to there's occasionally there will be guys over here on patrol that will shoot at your guy over here but I haven't had any problems crossing this bay so to speak and alerting the lieutenant too much the only time you get uh Oh, kind of looks like some partisans in custody right now. So you have some partisans kind of helping out here. Now, when you, if you saw that path, he tried to take it that way. Part of it's just kind of on their patrol patterns, stuff like that. Um, as long as you just kind of keep them moving and don't, even if you have to, you can take them all the way up here. If you don't feel safe, keeping them there. <clears throat> um, I just kind of space them out a little bit, as you can see right there. That's a guy right there shooting. Again, haven't had too many problems with it. Just send them. Now what you may have to do is you may have to pause activity here. Send them on their way, so to speak don't have an officer so they're shooting at the sniper dang so they're kind of advancing out which is fine but again I've actually not had them aggro this much, which is kind of unusual. I actually is kind of that is very unusual. I've never had them a aggro, I guess if you want to call it chase, so to speak. Будут указания. Are they really? This guy is seriously...
Oh my gosh, dude, this little cutscene, really? This guy's. I have never. I guess they have patched this, fixed it, or something. Well, maybe this isn't the way. Alright, well. I'll take that guy out. Yeah, again, I've never had this happen. Usually it's safe. I hit him in the head, how's he not dead? Oh, that wood got in my way. Interesting. I'm just kind of dumbfounded, I guess, if you want to call it that. Еще один готов. Oh, there he is. Hit him. Hit him again. Ждем дальнейших указаний. All right, well, again, that was kind of the uh, first time for everything, I guess. That was, I, like I said, that, I don't know, that's strange. I've never had it happen like that dang hmm. Hmm. I, I don't know that was weird so let's see here go ahead and sprint him all the way down here no no, what are you doing? Nope. Alright, for now. Miss Partisan. Alright, cool. Turn his off. Alrighty. The nice thing is, is the medic has quite a bit of stamina, so... Try to regen his stamina a little bit before I send him on his way for a sprint down this way. I've, again, I've had him chase maybe here, but then stop, and then I'm just kind of hidden the bushes, but that's kind of the very first time I've ever had him just chase all the way into the corner. I don't know, maybe some of y'all have had the same problems, but a little strange. Oh, 
Oh, go and stop. Yeah, good. He's not gonna. I don't think they're gonna come across. They might. I don't know. We'll look out and see. I don't think that they're gonna. Actually, we're just going to keep him back here for now. Какие будут указания? Ждем приказов. Так точно? Would like to go ahead and get over here. Take that guy out eventually. Need to get over here. Hmm. There's a that's a problem. Dang it. These guys are going to get compromised if we're not careful here. I'm just kind of dumbfounded at this. This would be kind of the time to go, I guess. Don't want them going this way. Basically, all I'm doing is just covering up the road, all these escape routes, so that this truck doesn't get out. Oh, that's why. He should be able to get through, no problem. Какие будут указания? I need to take these collaborators out is what I need to do.
že idem. Tak pošle. Ждем дальнейших указаний. Мы готовы. Мы готовы ко всему. Я. Да, товарищ командир. There's so many ways he can come out. It's crazy. Так точно. Мы готовы. Так точно. Я. Слушаю, командир. Ждем дальнейших указаний. Да, товарищ командир. Так точно. Да, товарищ командир. Ждем приказа. Готовы ко всему. Еще дышит. Ждем дальнейших указаний. See if I can sneak in here. I would almost bet I can't, but I need to take those guys out so I can mine this and keep going. Так точно. Can't see him, unfortunately. Gosh darn it. Какие будут указания? Есть. Какие будут указания? Я. Так точно. Maybe able to just keep on going then. Товарищ командир. Мы готовы. Как скажете.
какие будут указания? К бою готов! Ждем приказ! Can't go that way, there's mines everywhere. Мы готовы ко всему. Да, товарищ командир. All right, let's see here. We'll make him low crawl all the way across. I really need his Nagat pistol. he goes <laughs> hopefully you can build this quickly um oh Come on. There we go. He should be hidden now. There. He's going to low crawl. Ждем приказа. Какие 